Wayne Johnson. How's it going? Okay, Mr. Johnson, you have a school zone violation on Chow Street. Yep. In addition to that, you have two red light violations. Mm -hmm. The first is on the service road to Route 95. All right. And the second is on Branch and Childs. Do you remember this? You know, Branch, it probably was a while back. I don't, honestly, though. Honestly, you don't? I got so much on my mind, so I just, I can't really remember that day. Yeah. But if I see it, I'll probably remember. What have you got on your mind? What are you thinking of? What are all these things you're, you're thinking of? What's on your mind? It's everything. I got four kids, four baby mothers, like four different women. Like, you know what I mean? I'm just, I lost my stepdad from cancer. You got four kids with four different women? Yeah, so I'm just going through it. Yeah. It's not an excuse for anything, but no. you know what I mean? It's tough. So well, you got four women, I though. put myself in a situation, so I ain't trying to blame it on nobody, yeah. but you know what I mean? I just... You have four, you have four women to help you pay the fine. I wish. Maybe they'll all, you know, pitch in and try to help you out. If it was that easy, I was, I'd probably have all them stuff paid. Yeah. You mentioned who's sick. What's that? You mentioned someone has cancer. Who's sick? Oh, my, he passed away already. He, he actually was on a show. You had him do the Grape Street Slide. What were you doing? Were you dancing with your girlfriend? What was going on? Yeah, I had a little disco ball in my house and, you know... I just turned the music up when I didn't realize. Let me see your best move. Let me see your best move. Give me the Grape Street slide. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah, that was my stepdad, yeah. He passed away like uh, two years ago. Yeah. Yeah, from cancer, so. Yeah. So, you know, I just been on my mom, just making sure she's all right and stuff like that. But it's not an excuse for what's going on over here with the traffic stuff, but, you know. All right, Kara, let's look at 836. <laughs> this is the service road to Route 95. Take a look. Is that your vehicle? Oh, yeah, I do remember that. I probably was arguing with the mom that day, to be honest with you. Which one? <sighs> oh, probably the oldest, because she's the toughest one right now. <laughs> yeah, so I probably was. I probably was cussing her out, telling her, look at you, made me run the red light. <laughs> Oh, she was cussing at you? Yeah, all the time. It'd be over stupid stuff, though, but yeah. it's just annoying, you I mean, know what I mean? What, what could she be cussing you about? I mean, Because I'm trying to chastise my son. He always wants to cry oh. and call the mom. But now it's backfiring on her now because now I'm trying to discipline him. Now he's running around. She's like, now she wants to call me when he's getting in trouble. And I told her, look, see, you don't listen. But that's why I told her, don't be pampering him so much because now he's going to get used to it. And now, there's, now that he gets whatever he wants, you know what I mean? It's gonna, it just turns on him. What number is this wife? What number is she? Uh, she's the first. She, oh, she's the first? Yeah. yeah. And how old is the kid? He's 14. Oh. Yeah, he goes to Mount Pleasant High, so now it's like, but now he's giving mm -hmm. me attitude, and it's just tough. Like, yeah, he's talking to me like he's one of his friends. He's calling me his bro. Like, I'm not your bro, I'm your father. You want to borrow this when you talk to him? I can't even do it. Nowadays, you can't even do that. I'm <laughs> yeah, scared to even discipline him. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> she might put me in jail. I got a record. You know what I mean? He might go back and say all this extra stuff. So it's like, it's tough. You know what I mean? And it's sad because when I do be texting him and talking to him, he just talks to me like how, how if he wants to. You know what I mean? And I don't know. I do the best I can. That's all. Tell me the joys of parenthood. You have five children. You have five different ways. So tell me the joys about being a parent with these five kids. They actually helped me who I am today, to be honest. Oh, they helped you? Yeah, like... They helped form your character? Like, everything, you know what I'm saying? Like, the way I move, and especially, like, with my childhood growing up, you know what I mean? I wasn't perfect. Well, I'm happy to hear that you yeah, always keep you know, contact with yeah, all four of yeah, them. I try my hardest. I mean, I can't provide everything, <clears> but there's some dads, like, that don't even really care, they don't even try. Even if they, like, I don't got money like that, but... So I tried my hardest to be there. I'm happy to hear that you have a strong love and interest in your children, that you keep right. in contact with them and try to paste them on the right path in a way. So keep that up. It's going to cost you a total of $50. Here. All right. Thank you. All right. Good luck. All right. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm.